Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Thousand Year Door. I went ahead and took the liberty of meeting you guys here on this screen. Uh, this is a few over to the left from where we left off. Mostly because our goal right now is just to be backtracking to the beginning, so what's the point of really, like, watching me walk all the way back through there, right? So we might as well just go ahead and start here. And, uh... I thought they were on this screen, but I guess not. I'm trying to avoid all these battles. It can be a little bit tricky. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can avoid the rest of these. Come on. You kind of have to, like, fake out the piranha plants there. Hey, there they are. Well, if it isn't Mario. Shiny mustache or no, you can't be too bright if you came here looking for us. Mm -wee -hee -hee -hee. And you know why? Because we were waiting for you. Yeah, I kind of got that. Uh-huh, uh-huh, I remember. They're the ones with... Hey, wait a second. What do you mean you've been waiting for Mario? That sounds suspicious. A little bit. Mm -wee -hee 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 -hee. I have no quarrel with you, but I simply can't allow you to hunt for the crystal stars. And so, I'll be taking that little map of yours just as soon as I deal with you. Whoa, whoa, scary lady, how do you know about the map and the crystals? Have you talked to Princess Peach or something? Hey, now that I think about it, who are you anyway? Mwee hee hee hee. Those who seek names are often disappointed, but if you insist, we'll tell you. We are... The three. Holy crap, she actually said something other than go. I didn't know that ever happened. Shadow Beauties! The three Shadow Beauties? Vivian, you nickum-poop! What are you babbling about? It's Shadow Sirens! I don't see three beauties. I see two, but then there's you and your plug ugly! Aw. Ah, uh, right, sis. I'm sorry. It's just you always call us lovelies, and... It's just a figure of speech. Aw, oh, you've got some fierce punishment coming your way. <laughs> Aw, gee whiz. I hate being punished. Yeah, I don't think anybody really likes it, but whatever. That's for later, though. First, we have to deal with this Mario and his friends. Let's do it, my lovelies. Or rather, my lovely and ugly, Marilyn, Vivian. The might of the three Shadow Sirens will be more than enough to win the day. Okay. Alright, so now we're having uh, sort of a mini-boss battle here with the Shadow Sirens. It's most unlucky that our sights are set on you. Well, unlucky for you, of course. Marilyn, Vivian, let's show them precisely what we can do. Cool. Yes, yeah, sis. Why'd you have to put her in front? Why don't, you would put the big one in front, and then... Ah, uh, well, whatever, it doesn't matter. Alright, so I think now that we're here, we've got multiple enemies, this would be a good time to show off the new uh, special power that we got, Earth Tremor. Now, uh, the action command for this can be a little bit tricky. It's easy starting out, but like once it gets to the end of it, it actually starts getting almost luck-based, sort of. Basically, you just have to press A whenever these stars light up. Uh, you know, like I said, it starts out really easy, but eventually it starts getting so fast that... Uh, <laughs> it's pretty much just luck-based. Nice, got it. Alright, so when you hit all of them, or uh, you don't have to hit all of them, but if you do, you do more damage, of course. There we go, six to each of them, that's pretty awesome. Alright, and I also think I'm going to, uh... Well, I don't know. Yeah, let's put a shell shield on Mario, just so he's protected. We can go ahead and see this, too. Oh man, that, that one's pretty hard. I can never really get that one perfect, but... Ah, you're tougher than I thought, Mr. Mustache. I guess it's time to stop toying with you, hmm? What are you doing, Vivian? You twin, I'll never forgive you if you lose. S sorry, sis. Hey, you're losing too, alright? Yeah, these guys, it can be a little bit tricky to uh, actually know their action commands here. Yeah, it's, I kind of know when it's about to hit, but I, I can never seem to get it. Alright, uh, do we ha yeah, we have Power Smash, alright, we can use that. Let's just go ahead and, uh, I guess, take it out from the front here. Do a little backflipping. Oh, did I get Vivian? Yep, looks like it. Sorry, sis. Oh. <laughs> alright, and let's go ahead and do a Power Shell. We'll have enough for one more, uh, Power Smash after this. Oh, nice, and Beldum's gone, too. See, yeah, I mean, that, that little star power thing helps out quite a lot, actually. Offense plus two. Well, hopefully we can take her out this turn. We should be able to. Yeah, we did it. Cool. Alright, so, hey, what do you know? With our uh, newfound abilities, that was actually pretty easy, wasn't it? And we also leveled up, which is awesome. So, I mean, they, they can sort of stack on the damage a little bit if you're not uh, quick about it, I suppose. Uh, but we pretty much took care of that without too much trouble. Definitely BP. We haven't upgraded that once yet. We really need it, so. Wee hack! Ugh, maybe we're just a touch overconfident. 
Marilyn, Vivian, you lumps. We would've won if you two had pulled your weight. Both of you, prepare for a world-class punishment session when we get home. Gah. Ah, drop the necklace. Good. Mario, you're looking a little angry there, man. Are you alright? Alright. <laughs> I didn't know he stuck in that angry pose. That was weird. Alright, so we just picked up the necklace. Flurry's favorite, of course. That's the one we're going to have to return. So, what do you think our goal to do is now? Go all the way back to Flurry's place. That's right. And we get to avoid all the enemies on the way there. Which is a lot easier said than done. And pretty much just hold right for a few minutes. It seems to be a common theme of this chapter, right? It actually is going to get a little bit worse in a couple chapters. Uh, well, at least one that I can think of from here on out, but whatever. I guess, you know, this place isn't too bad looking, I suppose. I mean, I kind of I kind of bashed on it at the beginning just really because I'm not a fan of the chapter, I guess. What am I doing? Why am I going this way? This is the way to go. I just got so caught up on holding right. We need to go in this pipe and use the airplane panel. But... Yeah, and I, I kind of bashed on it, and I'm still not really a big fan, like, huge fan of how it looks or anything, but, I mean, it, it's okay, I guess. Whoa, that was close. You know, as long as you don't stare at the floor too much, but... <laughs> Alright, we should be almost there. Yeah, this is the screen right here. Let's see. Oh, we got, yeah, we got healed because of the level up. That's right, we don't need it. Okay. So, let's go in the pipe and make our way back into Flurry's house. You actually move a little, I think I mentioned this, we move a little faster if you jump in the background so it can speed things up by a couple seconds if you want, I guess. Alright. Hey, we got your stupid necklace. You gonna come help us now? Oh, you delightful fellow. You found my necklace. I'm beside myself, truly. But you still mustn't see me. Please leave the necklace by the door and wait a moment. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna have to do a little covert switch there. Okay, they could totally see her. The door was wide open. Oh, splendid, splendid, my oh-so-ravishing necklace. I'm awash in joy. Whoa. Okay, well, let's go. What's going on here? Holy crap. I want one of those. The, the lamp that turns into a disco ball. Holy jeez, what is going on here? Oh, oh my word. Mario, isn't it? Are you my heroic little necklace hunter? Uh, something like that. Well, my, 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 aren't you a fine specimen of a man? Yes, indeed. Yeah, okay, Mario's a little studly, but you don't need to point it out like that. I simply must thank you for your graciousness. But how to do it? Hmm, perhaps if I grabbed you and gave you a little sugar. Oh, please don't. For the love of everything that... <laughs> just please don't. Here I come, handsome. Time to give you a proper thank you. Pucker up. Uh oh Oh, no. Knock Coops and Punio out of the way. And... Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, Mario, you are just the cutest little thing I've ever laid eyes on. Yes, you are, and that's that. So tell me, are you truly looking for the crystal stars? No, we were just pulling your leg earlier. The very same crystal stars spoken of by all the lowlifes in Rogueport? Hmm, a danger-filled search for beautiful jewels. How absolutely marvelous. And here I was thinking how frightfully bored I was. It's time for a change. So are you going to help us or not, lady? And besides, I do declare that plush mustache of yours has completely swooned me. A man as manly as you must attract all sorts of trouble, and I want to keep you safe. So I dare say I'll be joining you on this little adventure. I assume that's fine, Mario. Well, I also assume we don't have a choice, but... Alright, so Flurry has joined our party. She's our next party member in Chapter 2. And we're going to get a nice little primer of her abilities here. Press X and Flurry will exhale strong gusts of wind that can blow things away. If she blows in the direction of an enemy, she can make its head spin for a bit. Hold down X to make Flurry exhale continuously. Okay, did, did you catch that? Let's watch it again. Like, are you serious? Did he have to grab her right there to do that? I mean, I, I want to know who who was the person on the development team that watched, like, that final animation and said, Yep, yeah, that's it. That's what we're going with. She's, he's going to squeeze her breast to make her exhale. I mean, I mean, come on. You, you could have done something else with that. That's That's just weird, man. This is wonderful. It's so nice that Flurry likes you, Mario. Really, it's great. And even more importantly, Flurry's chosen to join us. All right. So now that we've got our new party member, uh, I, I gotta say, I'm, I'm pretty much uh, she's pretty much useless in the, in this part of the chapter anyway. I can't get to the party menu for some reason uh, because of the whole spikes thing. We'll, we'll get to her attacks and everything later, but pretty much <laughs> when she's useful. I mean, there's a lot of enemies, you know. Uh, like I've already mentioned, they have the spikes, and we can't jump on them and stuff, and her attack is actually vulnerable to that as well. 
So, you know, it's it's kind of like it'd be a waste of time to try to use her on one of those. Uh, come on, get through there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> a little bit of trouble there. Anyway, it looks like we're about to run out of time, so in the next part we're going to showcase Flurry's abilities and uh, head into the Great Tree and hopefully finish up this chapter, well not in the next part, but sometime soon anyway. So we'll take care of that next time. Until then, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later.